say so, Paul Bachelorar. Today I'm out here reviewing the 2020 Anarchy Budweiser. Just breaking it in today. Be sure to be on the lookout for the full review. But first, a quick look at one of the products I'll be using as I break in the bat. In my opinion, the green pitching machine by Pop Toss is one of the best inventions for the slow pitch softball world. As you can tell by the name of the product, it is a pitching machine that launches 12 inch softballs and you don't need batteries, you don't need electricity, and it comes with a lifetime warranty. My family purchased one of these for me in 2018 for my birthday and I've loved it since day one. It's a great product to have if you want more live batting practice and you don't have a pitcher to throw to you. Down below you'll notice the link where you can purchase one of these. Be sure to use my affiliate code LIVEBP and save $8. As well as if you're looking for more information, you can check out my other reviews that I've done uh, in the links down below of this fantastic product. Is that two-piece bat for ASA only or USA only? This uses the cross-core technology. So I can be it's good for the 52 300 ball as well as some of the harder softballs, like the 44s. I tell you what, I have a compression tester now at home to test these bats. But one of the things I noticed is these Anarchy bats take a long time to try to get to peak performance. I mean, I got a, the pit bull, it's over 4,000 swings. It's still got room to go. The Anarchy Awakening I've been working on, it's over 1,200, and I still got quite a bit there. And I've been, you know, I, with that pit bull especially, I've been hitting a ton of, a uh, ton of swings with the, the hard softballs, and I can barely get it to move. So these are super durable. You really got to put the time into the Anarchy bats to really get the reward. Now this is the one ounce end load. This is an exact repaint of the. Anarchy Odin for 2020 and you can tell it's the one ounce because the red cap if it has the white cap then it's the repaint of the Anarchy Still Humble which has a half ounce end load. Now this only has, uh, I forgot to look where it came out but probably more like 40 swings or something like that. Probably not even. So it's going to perform decent right out of the wrapper, but like I said, you really got to get up. You got to get up into the thousands before you really see it. I mean, at least a thousand to get it ready. But uh, now that I see that compression, the compression numbers, you really got to got to get a lot of hits on these. This is a 26 ounce sticker. Uh, I forget what it is now. I think it's 26.2 or 26.4 on the scale. I'll put that number down below. Now the pop toss, you can adjust the timing for longer or shorter. That one's off the 330 Monster. That away, Budweiser. The only two bats today to get over that are actually the Monster Laser Show is the only 100 of these made one piece. Uh, and then the Torch Light, 22 ounce balance, but man, that thing can smash. Sinister didn't even make one over yet today. Maybe one that was off to the side though. But I'd say this bell is one of the more consistent for me today. You know, that one ounce envelope just real nice and smooth through the zone. Not trying to give my opinion quite yet. I'm just uh, reporting the facts of the day. Now you have several other Anarchy bats that are one ounce end load, like the uh, the Rebellion, the Ambassador. Uh, let's see. Those are the first two that come to my mind. Uh, both solid bats. Justin Trella sent me up the ambassador I sold them earlier in the year to swing again. I miss that bat sometimes. Great bat. Now, earlier in the season, 
some of these anarchies for 2020 we're having uh, problems with the restrictor coming loose like I had the pit bull came loose two of the st still humbles uh, another amp that I have now the restrictor had gone uh, and then when I when I got my pit bull back it was 0.3 ounces heavier than when I sent it so I don't, I don't know what's going on apparently the issue has been resolved by the time this one came out uh, I don't know that for a fact if you know more information feel free to leave that down below I don't have you know the backstory of that I'm just reporting what I hear from others or see on online uh, but I don't know if that's true or not uh, but I, I do know that I had restrictors go and I've been told that the issue is resolved uh, even if it goes though uh, they resolve it for free you go and fill out the warranty and on their website and they'll send you a label uh, shipping label send it back it's a pretty good turnaround time you'll get it back have to break it in again though that's what I've been trying to do with my pit bull it left amazing and it's never been the same since I am excited to see this one because this feels like that ambassador more Yeah, it was it was a knuckleball. It still went pretty good. Let's just check out the sinister here. Now, granted, this is a couple thousand swings. This is a one-piece, 25-ounce mid-load. Come on, sinister! That away. Over the 330 monster with ease. That away. That's the long ball of the day. That away, sinister. By the way, uh, the Unleashed, the Bat Hound Unleashed, the Monster Bat Hound Unleashed, uh, just released for pre order two days ago on the 21st of September 2020. Uh, last I checked, today's the 23rd. There were still some on there. One per customer in the 2500 flex and the 3900 stiff handles. 2500 is what has given me the highest radar numbers. 3900 has given me the best distance. But that's a good bat to get. Check it out. All right, two more for the Budweiser. You can get that unleashed on monsterathletics.com. Budweiser. See, I think this is going to be a good one because that was off the end of the bat. I did not hit that that well at all. all right, I look forward to getting this one broke in. Hey, that one got it too. That was a softer ball. Let's give another one here to the Budweiser. Boy, Budweiser, I look forward to seeing where you go. That away! That away! Hey, let's give it another one. We got three in a row there. You know, I'm up in Milwaukee, so you know, it's Budweiser rule. You know, I don't know. Budweiser on a roll! Yes! See, it's just a I feel like a nice and consistent bat. That's what I felt with the ambassador. Nice one on send load. All right, we'll shut it down there. Hey, be sure to check out the website, thebathound.com. There you'll find stats on the bats, uh, merchandise, used bats, video archives, product recommendations, and more. Be on the lookout for the full review of the Anarchy Budweiser for 2020, repaint of the Anarchy Odin. Feel free to leave any questions, comments down below. This is the Bat Hound. Everyone's sounding off. Be sure to subscribe to the channel up here. Check out some other videos up here. Check out and some, down here. Thanks, check out some bat, build, bat, uh, bat Pop videos too. Don't forget that. <laughs> That's right, buddy.